At the BBC One psychological reality show, The Traitors, has become an overnight sensation. The show had millions of viewers hooked on the twists and turns of this tense game show. There were 12 nail-biting episodes and 22 contestants. Some were faithfuls and some were traitors uh, that were murdered and double-crossed, or they would murder and double-cross contestants. The final result is the faithfuls finally thwarting the traitors and sharing the £101,000 prize pot between them. Well, we're glad to say we're joined uh, by three of the standout stars of the show, traitors Amanda Lovett and Kieran Topstead and faithful winner Aaron Evans. Hello to all of you. Good morning. So, um... Do you all get on? I mean, it was scheming, it was backstabbing. I was surprised, actually, that you two were still speaking to each other. <laughs> Is that why you put us uh, apart? Yeah, exactly, yeah, absolutely. We put us in the middle. Yeah. Exactly. Me and Amanda are absolutely fine, yeah. Yes. We all still talk, we have a, we have a group together. Um, I don't think anyone can have a problem with... Obviously, sharing that great experience with each other, so we all done something quite unique. So yeah, we all we all sort of trauma bonded for life. I well, I was actually traumatized when I saw the first episode. So was I. And to be fair, I'm loving uh, the new Claudia in a way. She's one. She's like cruel, <gasps> isn't she, or whatever? She's got ice cold. Yeah. I totally agree with you. Yeah. But you. Oh, where do you think you are? You're going to be a winner. You're going to be a loser. There you are, a loser. Well, take it for real. You are clear off. Brutal. Yeah, absolutely brutal. Um, they didn't tell Did us you about... cry? Because you never even got in the castle at first. <laughs> Ten minutes it was, yeah, and then we had the, the lonely walk down the driveway, So, and they told us about half an hour later, so that we, we were coming back, so it was a long half hour. Yeah, I was, I was ready to get the uh, mick taken out of me for the rest of my life. <laughs> uh, being poor Dr Amos. <laughs> so, Amanda, why, I mean, why did you want to go on this in the first place? What was the, what was the appeal to you? Um, well, I just think as a nation we love reality TV um, and it, it's always been that it's very much for the youngsters or you have to be a celebrity. So when I seen this advertised on social media, I thought, well, yeah, you know, I'm over 50 and I can have a go because it's diverse and, yes, I'm going to go for it. So what was the interview like that you went through? Because I'm sure oh, lots of people was, must have applied. How did yeah. you get, make the cut? Um, we had to go through about six or seven. It took about three months of um, interviews and, um, yeah, they w wanted to know about our medical history and everything. And I think they just wanted someone from Wales and I, I wanted to be an ambassador. <laughs> I wanted to be an ambassador for, you know, over 50-year-old women to show that we're not just packaged up, we're not just um, sort of going to go under the radar, that we're going to get out there and... Gorgeous uh, and yes. feisty. Let, yeah. let's, bring, let's bring Aaron in. Aaron, um... Thanks for joining us. Do hey, you... guys. Oh, hello. Here he is. How are you doing? You all right? Do you want to gloat to, uh, <laughs> want to, gloat to Amanda? <laughs> not at all. Not at all. Not at all. They played and an amazing game. Distance. They played an amazing game. <laughs> so it's credit to them. And so what was, um, I mean, what, how, what was the appeal for you for going on the show? You're not from Wales. So what was... <laughs> what, 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 what no, was not at all. Not at all. Um, so I initially got um, scouted um, through social media. And the way that it was explained to me, it was like it was going to be kind of like an I'm a celebrity um, mixed with a little bit of, um, you know, other reality TV shows with all these like challenges. So that's kind of what appealed to me initially. And then when they just um, spoke about kind of the diverse cast that was going to be on there, um, I just thought like I had to be part of it. I've been asked to go on other TV shows before, but I never really wanted to. Um, but this one just really like stuck out to me. Oh, OK. You see, I thought it was for your mum and you were going to give your mum the prize money. He's changed his mind now. Well, <laughs> yeah, well, so, no, no. so, initially, so initially interview. going on there, I didn't actually think I was going to make it all the way to the end. And then you get to day, I think it was probably day 10. I think it was roughly around day 10, day 9 or 10. And then everyone and then everyone starts thinking about the money. And then I was like, oh, my God, I could actually win this at this point. Before <laughs> that, you don't actually really think you could actually win it because everything's out of your control. Um, so yeah, it was uh, it was just it was it's just a crazy experience. So, but the so, whole way through, I did have my I thought mom. I was going to say double crossed his mom. Well, it sounds yeah. like he has double crossed. I'm <laughs> the real traitor. Have you, has, has she got her, her check yet? Has she got her share of the winnings that you promised? He's yeah, gone in Barbados. She sat. So I did actually lie. I'm not giving her all of it. I've given her thirty thousand. Um, so she's oh, probably yes. sat, loving all this like wow. interest that she's getting from it at the moment. 
Um, but no, she she's going to be waiting until kind of next summer, maybe end of the year, once the once the market dips down a little bit more, um, and then once she finds a house that she wants, then she'll be putting the deposit down. Oh. But she's got it secure in her bank account. See? I'm not allowed to spend it. So. <laughs> that's a winner for you. See? Yeah, yeah, that, 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 that is. That's, that's what... Now, Amanda, I wanted to ask you. You for, for most of the show, you were you seem to be the favourite to win. Did, I mean, did you go in with a did you go in with a game plan that you were you were determined to stick to? Um, no, it was just sort of um, mum by day and murder by night, you know? Um, <laughs> as we call in Wales. No. <laughs> I just sort of, yeah, I, I just sort of, right, I'm going to sort of mother hen everybody, get them under my wings so they trust me, <laughs> and then, um, yeah, go from day to day. But it is quite, in, it's so intense in there. You do sort of live day to day in there, don't you, Kieran? And, and yeah. It's, yeah. And then you but got stitched it, up. My by little, but, yeah, yeah, I got, and then stitched, you got stitched up. up. You got stitched up by somebody. Um, yes. Yeah. Yes. Not Here me. he is. Not me. He's the other one. Will. Well, I was. Yeah. <laughs> I, was just, have you, have I, th I think it was a bit of a duo going on there. Yeah. But, you know. Have you been in touch with him? <laughs> yeah, we, all, we we've got a, a group between us. We all like. I think a lot of people are amazed that we all still talk, but we do. Yeah, we, we we're absolutely fine. It's the lines drawn in the sand, and we all just carry yeah, on with normal life. He lost to a few bob, though, didn't he? Just a bit, yeah. <laughs> just a <laughs> bit. Yeah. Fifty just grand to be precise. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, no hard feelings. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. so, I mean, I personally thought this was a new direction for shows. I thought this was fantastic. I, I thought I'm yeah. a celebrity yes, was, yeah. you know, finished, yeah. sort of apprenticeship yeah. finished. Mm. Can we see, more, you know, more of these? And what was the difference between this and another TV I, I show? I think it, uh, it, everything just came together at the right time. I think that the cast... Uh, the Studio Lambert, BBC, Claudia, the format, the castle, the, castle, castle, the, yeah. the time, everything just worked this the time. The picture of you in the castle. Yeah, it, it, real, it just came together. Yeah. Sorry, and real people yeah. living yeah. it, you know, that um, it wasn't scripted at all, no. it was all real emotion. So diverse you've got from Aisha to yeah. Andrea, um, Kieran having the, I don't want to put any spoilers out there, but having... You know, an absolute fantastic part in the end, really. But like twists said, and turns it was, every day. It was from a doctor to a magician. Yeah. It was everybody. And I think yeah. that's what I like, the mix of people. Yeah. Is, is Avon still with us? Because um, I am still with yes. I, <laughs> I wanted to know, uh, Aaron, what, you know, you said you turned down um, offers in the past. What, what's, what does the future hold now? What, what's your plan um, on the back of this success? Well, it's... It yeah, so it's all a little bit up in the air at the moment. So my original plan was to actually um, <laughs> take the £3,000 that I had and go travelling at the end of this month. But now I've had so many different um, kind of opportunities coming through my way. I'm actually pushing it back a couple of months okay. just so I can do kind of these other things. Um, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to see where that kind of takes me first. Um, a bit more. I don't know whether or not I'll get back on reality TV, but I'm doing like a, a few public appearances, even with Kieran and Amanda. Um, we're doing different even, things. So even, I'm just, I'm just I think where even with, with the even with the losers. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> well, <laughs> <laughs> can't call them that. I don't know if you heard. We're all winners. We're all winners, guys. All of us. I don't know if you heard, Aaron, but Kieran was suggesting you went on Naked Attraction, and uh, I mean, we, we actually have had somebody on the show from Naked Attraction as well. Just thrown it out there. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> no, I, anyway, no, I don't know. I don't know if that's thank you for me. thank you for making the series such a such a hit. Uh, so, Aaron, Kieran, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Good luck for the future.